Welcome back to Final Fantasy VII. I'm here today, Tim Plumstein, and we're going to continue along with the story of Cloud, Tifa, and Barrett. Hopefully today we're going to get a bit further in. Let's see. And hopefully we'll make some more money, because I think he's promised us 2000 for this job. Yep, Cloud. So the next question we'll ask is... Ah, yes. So basically, this is just a tutorial. So this is what I was trying to explain to you a couple of videos back. So it's going to show us how to put our uh, material on. We can change the order of our people where we want. Okay, now we're in the menu. It's just going to run us through how to use material. As you can see, we've got material slots in our weapon there. So these are the slots that we use to put these magical rock ball things. As you can see, this is the one that gives us cure. There we go. Boom. And now we can use cure, which will be ever so helpful because that way we won't have to keep relying on uh, items. And it will heal us for a lot more as well, especially if we get our music up and so, And we can use it outside of battle as such. That's it. That's basically all this is saying. Let's uh, skip through this a bit quicker, shall we? There we go. Easy, yep. Yeah. Play material on, bloody, bloody, blah. We can take it off as well. It's just one thing we've got to be careful. Whenever we put material on, our status has changed, so yep, as you can see down here, we'll reduce our strength a little bit and our max HP by minus 0.2%, so it's not too bad. But some of them uh, will reduce a lot more, the more powerful they are as well. I can't wait until I get regen from this, because you can level up your material in this, and I quite like that, rather than specking into certain edges to get... Edges? I, I read the word edge then. Specking into certain areas to get uh, better magic or better skills. This one, uh, you actually level up the skill itself by using it more and uh, battling with it. So you get, um, it's called PP, something like that. And uh, that's what levels up our uh, magic. So it's actually, well, more certain enemies give certain, certain uh, more uh, magical powers. I could do with a massage. <laughs> oh, I got a message. I thought it says I could do with a massage. Jeez. Oh, I really misread that, didn't I? I could do with a massage, though. And you guys want a massage out there? Go get yourself a massage. You all deserve to relax. I hope you are all nice, laid back and relaxed there watching this video. I think if I go over here, there's a weapon shop. So we could do with some... Ooh. That was out to see you. Boom. How do you shoot? Oh, it's targets up there. Can't just walk in here without buying some. God, imagine if all shops are there. Uh, perhaps I already got that. Well, let's not buy a little bit of those. Three of those. I don't want to eat grenades, fuck the grenades. Let's upgrade our equipment, shall we? As always with RPGs. He's got a massive sword. She, he's got a massive gun, and she's got a glove. Seems a bit unfair, really. But what she can do with that glove is amazing. He's... I think we'll give her the cure. She can be our, she can be our white mage for now. No one fucks with the white mage. Yeah, give him time kill. Fuck it, have money. What's this? 
I set the fan for a while. Ah! Random material on the floor in there. What's that? All material. That was the material. Next, take this treasure chest. Hey, Ethan. What? What the hell's going on there? It basically explains to me that I can pick shit up. And I can use this as a saving. Right up. We'll, we'll have a quick cheeky save, shall we? Beginner's Hall. There you go, we've got free material there. And I, if I remember rightly, if I do this. So now we'll do lightning on all of our enemies. There we go. Hopefully I won't put too much material on that will uh, make us a bit too weak. Because I'll, I want Cloud to be a bit of the uh, powerhouse. Come on, get up. Oop, there's a meeting going on over there. I think we'll be joining that in a minute. Ah, ho. Oh, oh. Cool. I don't know what he was doing there. Fuck it. Got a large mission to take care of, but we've got time for a sleep. Can I look around the room? Is there anything else in there? These beds look super comfy, actually. I, I would. Looks like a bit of a shithole of a room, but I wouldn't, uh, I wouldn't say no to. That would fuck your ankles up. Fuck that. It'd fuck my ankles up, anyway. I ain't a badass. Not like Cloud and these lot. What's this? Is this an item shop? I don't, I don't know what these places are. It's been a very long time since I've played Ah, yes. Medicine. Tell me medicine, because I may have used a bit too much during that last boss. Here, I didn't know that. Shit. Oh well, too late now. <laughs> I spent my money. That'll do us. We've got, we've got some items there, so if we do get in a bit of trouble again, we will hopefully won't die. But I'm not making any promises, because there will be points in this game where I will die a lot. There's one boss especially that I remember that I used to uh, struggle against a lot. What's going on here? Oh, these are the families and friends of uh, everyone. I'm leaving, going far away. Come back and right there, man. This is my I better take care of uh, Tifa. Yes, I will take care of Tifa. Which way are we going? We're going up? No? We're going right. I don't know where I'm going. We'll go this way. Ah, this is, this is the right. These two are still chatting. Jeez. I've had it. What the fuck? The he Did they just knock each other? What the? Right, okay then. <laughs> Whatever. No, sir. Okay, fair enough. I'm still confused about those two on the floor. I don't know what they just did. to get a train. Final Fantasy is quite like their trains actually. Not as much as their airships, but they do seem to like their trains a lot.
Yeah, I wouldn't fuck with a guy who's got a gun for an arm. Oh, fucking hell. It's a bit much, isn't it? You lucky bastard. <laughs> See, I promise you guys, he is, he is meant to be a good guy. He's not meant to be a bad guy, but he does come across as a right arsehole. He's just there. Uh, I think he's got some inadequacy issues. Sleeping on the train before. That's right next to me. So I've got to look at that green mess of what's apparently in that. In my house. Is this a homeless guy who just is constantly on it? Fair enough. Oh, okay, I couldn't even talk to the crying guy. Ooh. Flirting. It's over 9,000! I've never actually seen what happens if uh, we ran out of... Oh, is it literally 15 seconds? I had 15 seconds to get out of that one car. Oh, I see. I really wonder what happens if the time runs out. Oh, there's no! Oh, okay. So this is what happens when the time runs out. Maybe there was better things further down, I don't know. They're just jumping off and moving trains. Fuck that. Oh, uh, there we go. Oh, okay. Seems to be extreme, doesn't it? I don't know if I messed that up or not. <laughs> I might have messed that up. if I go this way. Can I follow the train? I, I know I'm going the wrong way but I'm hoping that I'll find something maybe. Maybe there's something good up here, maybe there's not. What the hell are they? Ooh. Silk. Oh my god, they essentially cat people. Show off some of that magic now. Put the all on there. Okay, Tifa, that was a bit pants, wasn't it? That's more like it. Boom! That's better. We need to get you something a bit better than the leather glove, I think. Thinking if I go all the way this way, whilst it might be a waste of time. I'm hoping there's something down here. Never know, it might actually be the right way, I'm not sure. Shimmer of security guards. Oh, there, we've got to turn back. No, I want to fight him. Hell yeah! 
Oh, these are red. They're different. Oh, they do. Like, an extra one damage. You're not gonna kill it, are you? Oh, okay. Oh, they're a bit tougher than the other ones. Not that much tougher, though. I wish I could have Barrett one of them, they look amazing. Boom. I think that was a crit she got when she did 56 damage anyway. See, already a bit more action in this one. Ah, and the dice. Boom. The terrorist attack. Intruders. Stay here. Can I outlast them, maybe? Shall we see if we can outlast them, eh? This will take care of the rest of them if they don't die. She's quite good at getting the old crits, so... Maybe that's her thing. Maybe she does low damage, but she's got a high crit chance for tons of damage. So if this is getting me kill and XP is all the better really, isn't it? And a bit of money. I'll do it one more time and if 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 it keeps doing it then I'll run away. Because maybe maybe you can't essentially beat him, maybe it's one of those like you just gotta kind of deal with it scenarios where I have to go. I'm hoping that's not the case. I'm hoping maybe I can beat him a few times. Boom. That all material is amazing. It just makes you absolutely fuck up the rest of them. Okay, now, is it going to do the same thing? Okay, we'll run. I don't want to run. Okay, so that's all that was that way. So I can't go that way. If you know that anything could have happened on that, if I had stayed, let me know. I'm just curious, really. Ah, damn it. Is it going to be those silky son of a bitches? I like that it's not always free on free as well, because some, some of the old games is... To be fair, some of the old games was like 10 on 3. I don't know what that suit does, it doesn't seem to hurt. I'm not sure, does it like slow us down maybe a little bit? I'm really confused. Squish the birds. The soundtrack for this game is amazing. But the, I believe the person doing the soundtrack for the remake is the person who did the soundtrack for Final Fantasy XV, which, if you haven't heard, is incredible. It is really good. She, like, I think, it's a female composer, and she did a fantastic job of it. Like Final Fantasy. It's known for having good story and good music. But that's the way I know it. It's catchy music that you just love to listen to and you know, if you're if you're very lucky, a good story. But that's not always the case with say Final for instance, Final Fantasy thirteen, that the storyline garbage on that one. Hey. Fuck you guys. Be a bit more conservative with my MP, maybe a little. You don't heal in between your battles, though, in uh, this one, like you do in 15. Well, heal up to your max HP. The HP system in that was very different. Like, you had a max HP and you had your HP. And depending if you died or not, your max HP, it was weird. It worked, but it was weird. It was almost like you had two HP bars that you had to take care of. And elixirs weren't like. Mega rare. 
They were fairly rare, but you could then eventually buy them, which I don't think you can do in most other Final Fantasy games. <laughs> I know it's a waste of MP, but it's just the quickest way to get through this is just to blitz them all with a bolt. And attacks don't cost nothing, so back we'll just get a cheeky little shooting. There's so many of these fucking assholes. It's not like Pokemon either where I can put a bloody repel on them and they just fuck off. Well this is good, it's getting us a little bit of XP and gets a bit of the grinding out of the way, I guess. Although early game grinding is not not so bad in this because you can always face a tough enemy and just take a lot of healing items here. Or even just use cure. Looks like the box gets cut off a bit there. Let's go down. Don't care if it gives you the chills, we're going down there. There's something as well that's quite rare in these games. I don't think you can buy ethers. I might be wrong. I can't remember, but I, I seem to remember ethers being a bitch to get your hands on. I love the level designs in this as well. They're very simple, but like the, the attention to detail is quite high for the time. Like, whilst it is a bit nitty and gritty, it's still very uh, detailed for what it is. Are they flying fish? Hell bubbles. What the fuck? Oh, it puts you to sleep. Son of a bitch. Oh, these are tough motherfuckers as well. Well, they're tougher than everything else. I've got. And that worked wrong. Hey, where do you go, Tifa? Get slapped around the face and just punch him back. Not a woman you want to piss off. Biggs! Biggs, how are you, man? So that's the right level. What's up that? Maybe I should have went up the other ladder first, see what's up there. Oh, we'll, we'll see how this goes. Jesse, how you doing? Oh, sorry, what about? Ah, uh, don't worry about it. Ooh. Let's go this way. We'll crawl through the bin. We'll try and be all stealthy like. Oh, that's where that leads. Oh, okay, so basically I could have just skipped the whole conversation with Biggs. I don't really want to be staring at your ass, clown. All of that one polygon. <laughs> really, whatever shape you are. He has cube hands. It's a Minecraft in the invent of human graphics. <laughs> I'll talk to you in a second. I'll loot first. Ten. Boom. Okay, so I'm thinking this might be a uh, might be a bit of a bigger bigger battle area, maybe, because they're giving me the stuff to uh, heal myself with. So we shall see. But it's only because I can do that and just cane through enemies and just move on. Get on with it. I see, so you get XP which is your levels and you get AP which is the one that goes for your um, material. I don't know 
why I get, I don't know where I'm getting PP from. There might be Pokemon, I have been playing a lot of Pokemon in my spare time. Oh, he, he's off. A bit more intricate than the last job, I guess. Whee! Who said jobs can't be fun? Whee! That looked like a lot of a that looked like a larger drop than it was. Ah, oh, this was familiar. We just went a different way into this one. You would have thought they would have designed these a little bit more easy to roam around than jump over this large gap of death. Ah! when I come across an enemy that I can't use bolt on. If this doesn't kill him, I'll be surprised. That's how it is done. It seems very easy at the moment, but it, it does get challenging. Right at this moment in time it is very easy, but this is still early game. This is this is still like in the realms of tutorial, kind of. I like that they look they look very similar to the last one. It does look ever so slightly different as well. Saved the game for today. We've grinded quite a bit. We've managed to make it into the reactor. I think we are going to uh, leave it there for now, and uh, we shall continue next time and see where this leads to. Will we blow it up? Will it go smoothly as it did last time? Or will it not? Any time will tell. See you later, guys, and remember to like and subscribe if you enjoy what you're seeing. You're all wicked. See you later.